The rise of AI has been very, very exponential these last couple of years. And with that, the rise of AI writing tools and also AI detectors have come up. Now, obviously there's ChatGPT, Copilot, Gemini, and a whole bunch of other AI tools that you can use to write essays, proms for school, for college, for work in general. Now, obviously there's different AI detectors like GPT-0, 0, zero GPT, copy leaks, turn it in and more that can basically check whether these tools like ChatGPT or anything like that wrote the essay or not. Now, a workaround is obviously AI humanizers, which have been vastly growing this past year. Today, we're going to be checking one of them out. It's called Twin GPT, and it's been on the rise. It gets hundreds of millions of views on Instagram with their very interesting use of AI to market their product. So today, we're going to be putting it to the test, seeing if it can actually humanize its text well enough to bypass all these different AI detectors. So first, as you can see, you got on the website, Twain GPT, it's a very minimal design. As you can see, trusted by over 2.1 million people, which is a lot of people. Humanize your writing, that's, I'm guessing, the slogan. Our AI humanizer transforms any AI-generated text into an undetectable human-like content. We're gonna be testing that out today. As we pulled down the website, obviously, it says, it shows the layout of the actual product, trusted by top writers everywhere, Princeton, Google, Penn State, Harvard, Stanford. It's a bunch of Ivy Leagues and very notable schools. Built for everyone, humanize any AI generated text. This is basically who the product is marketed for, writers, marketers, or bloggers. Why Twain GPT? They give so many different reasons why, as you can see, it's an advanced AI humanizer, multi-language support, over a hundred different languages, very convenient. Now, the pricing. Basic plan, $8 a month, billed annually, 8,000 humanized words, 100 ad tech uses, 50 generated uses, watermarks and future proof. Actually, not a bad deal. $8. That's just, I think this is like below average what I think other AI detectors charge. Premium is obviously this is the most popular one, so I'm guessing this is the one that most people go for. 30,000 words, 500 AI detector uses, 200 generator uses, watermark and future proof, and priority support. So if you have a problem, you can always go to the customer support to help you out. That's always a good thing. And the ultimate, which is 40. You get unlimited humanized words, unlimited tech users, unlimited writing generated. So basically you get unlimited everything. It's actually really not bad. This is the annual, obviously says 20% off. So monthly, also oh, monthly is a little bit more expensive. It's $2 more, $5 more for the premium and $10 more for the ultimate. But that's really not that bad. Still $10 a month for a tool that could save you tens if not hundreds of hours of work. Not a bad deal. But overall, this website is very minimalistic, but it gets the job done. Now. We're gonna be using ChatGPT to write a prompt. We're first gonna be checking whether that paragraph is AI or not. And then we're gonna be using Twain to rewrite it. And we're gonna be putting it into all those detectors that it claimed it would work in and see if it actually works. Let's go. Okay, so first things first, we obviously have to get ChatGPT to write us a paragraph about something. So let's say, write me a quick para paragraph about why Ch uh, GPT is the best AI. Gonna write us a quick little paragraph. We are going to copy it. We're gonna go to GPT zero. I'm gonna copy it. So as you can see, we are highly confident this text was AI generated. So obviously that means that our AI detectors are working. So now all we have to do is go onto twaingpt.com. And obviously disclaimer, I did actually reach out to Twain asking if I can get some free credits to do a review on it and they kindly said yes and they gave me over 30,000 credits which is very very nice of them i did just mess around with it before that you can see it's not exactly 30,000 we're just going to copy and paste the text and click on humanize and now we're going to see how long it's going to take That was pretty quick. That was probably less than 10 seconds. So we are going to copy this text and the first AI detector that we're going to use is obviously GPT-0. We're going to copy and paste this text and scan. And just like that, we are highly confident this text is entirely human. So GPT-0, done. Twain absolutely destroyed it. 100% human, not even 1% AI generated. That's very impressive. Now, we're gonna go to probably the second biggest AI detector, which is zero GPT. We are going to put this text in and let's see if there's any AI. <laughs> what? Zero percent AI GPT. Twain got a hundred percent on GPT zero and zero GPT. And no, then the crazy part is, is that if you don't get a hundred percent, 
you could get a free retry and it'll redo it for free and you might actually get 100 percent wow i am very very impressed okay so now we have copy leaks which is another really good ai detector that actually works really well so now we're going to see we're going to paste our twain text and we're going to see no ai content found instantly i'm very very surprised like you would think that at least one of these ai detectors because they're all different and they're even though they're all the same they all detect whether text is ai or not they're all made a little bit differently and you would think that maybe twain would mess up on one of them it's three for three perfect zero percent ai i don't know who these guys are that made twain but they must have some sort of inside information on how to bypass everything because they created some algorithm that absolutely destroys all these AI detectors. Oh my God. Lastly, we have Quillbot. We're not actually gonna do all of the AI detectors, all seven or eight of them that are out there because as you can see, the results are the exact same. So if it's gonna be the exact same for the first three, it's probably gonna be how it is for the rest of them. But we're gonna test out Quillbot too, which is another really good AI detector and is very trusted. So we're gonna paste the text, detect all. I'm not gonna lie, I'm shocked. 0% AI for all four of the AI detectors that we tested. This this humanizer can actually put all of these all of these detectors out of business. Four of the most major and the biggest AI detectors out there, it got 0% for all of them. When I when I was gonna do this review, I, I was thinking like, it's probably not that good. I, a lot of people were hyping it up. Obviously the testimonies, there were people saying how it's amazing. I didn't believe it. Like I, I genuinely didn't. Testing it out, like I'm actually shocked. 0% AI for all four. I, I, I gotta put my hat down to Twain, man. Whoever, whoever made it, bro, the guys who developed this or the team that developed this, they did a fantastic job, genuinely. So guys, if you guys need an AI humanizer that goes undetected in any AI detector, 0% yet yeah, Twain guys it is truly great Twain is the best AI detector I've ever used I'm gonna put a link below for Twain they give you 250 free words to try out if you like it buy a membership highly highly recommend it thank you so much for watching links gonna be down below like and sub thank you so much